First thing you notice about backing up a tractor trailer is if the trailer turns in the opposite direction that you're turning the steering wheel. Right now this tractor is sitting in a straight line with a trailer and you can tell by looking out each mirror and you won't see the sides of the trailer. Now let's say you want to move the trailer a little bit to the left toward the driver's side. Put it in reverse, turn the wheel a little bit to the right. Look out your left hand mirror, you start to see the side of the trailer, and it's moving to the left. Okay, we'll pull up again. Reverse. Now we'll turn the wheel a little bit to the left. Look out the right hand mirror, you start to see the trailer moving to the right. Now as you're backing up, you just uh, make corrections with your wheel. If you see, see the trailer drifting too far to the left or the right, let's say you want to put it next to that flatbed back there. Let's say you want to get a little closer, a little bit to the left. So turn the wheel a little bit to the right. The trailer's moving a little bit to the left. If you don't want to get too close, back over to the left. You see it straightening out again. Right now it's going straight. You don't have to make too many corrections with the wheel. Okay, that was about as basic as you can get as far as showing what happens when you turn the steering wheel. This is what was happening back there when I was backing up. The tractor without a trailer on it acts just like your car when you turn the steering wheel. Turn the wheel to the right, and when you back up, it follows this angle of your steer tires, and the back of the tractor goes to the right. Now when you hook a trailer to it, the only part of the trailer touching the ground are the wheels back here. And it pivots on those wheels and where it's hooked to the tractor. So now when you turn the wheels to the right, the back of the tractor goes to the right just like before. It pushes the front of the trailer to the right. And because it's pivoting on those wheels, the back of the trailer goes to the left. And that's why the trailer goes in the opposite direction you're turning the steering wheel. The next couple of videos I'll talk about what I think are the four things you need to do to make a good backup. That's your setup. Set the angle, follow the trailer, and make corrections. The main thing to remember is to back up slowly. Almost any problem you're going to find while backing up can be solved by going slowly. If you think these videos are helpful, let me know and leave a comment. If you have any questions, you can go to my website.